Okay, look at this. And in each cylinder I have intake exhaust, intake exhaust. I don't know if this is intake or this is exhaust. I need to verify if the intake port is in front, in front of this, no? Okay. And the exhaust port probably is in front of this, yeah? Intake exhaust, intake exhaust. This is the intake manifold and this is the exhaust manifold. And this is the turbo. Let me explain the turbo, it's too simple. When the engine is running, produce gases. Mm -hmm. And the gases enter in the exhaust manifold and enter, the turbo have one shaft with two turbines. One turbine is moved by the gases, the smoke, this one. It's called the hot side, because it's the gases, the hot turbine. Mm -hmm. In the other side, you have another turbine with the blades in opposite direction. <laughs> what is the meaning of that? When the turbo spin, excuse me, when the gases spin this turbine, the other turbine sucks on fresh air and compress the air and the air enter in the intake manifold. And finito, this is the turbo. Look, the, the atmospheric air, atmospheric pressure, enter here. Look in this elliptical area. The air is compressed at high pressure, high pressure, high pressure, high pressure, and the air enter at high pressure and high temperature in the combustion chamber. Nice, no? Do you remember in a typical gasoline engine, in a typical gasoline engine here, at the input of the intake manifold, you have the carburetor, you remember? With the throttle, mm -hmm. and the throttle mixed air from the air filter and fuel entering in one side of the carburetor. You remember that? Mm -hmm. And in the intake manifold enter the mixture. And how you control in your gasoline car the RPMs? Oh, With the movement it? of the throttle. Mm -hmm. yeah. For that reason they say this is throttle body. No? You remember? Yeah. When this when this flap is vertical, I have maximum amount of air entering. Mm -hmm. This is wide open throttle. Mm -hmm. And this is Restrict. idle. And this is completely closed. Mm -hmm. Yes or not? In a gasoline car. In diesel, pay attention. This is diesel. This engine is naturally aspirated or turbocharged? It's turbocharger, no? But uh, in the intake manifold, in the intake manifold, I don't have a throttle body. I don't have any element to accelerate. The air enter directly in the intake manifold and enter directly in the intake valve. Where I accelerate the engine, the diesel engine. In the fuel injection pump, look. Can you see that handle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you accelerate, yeah. You see? Mom, 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 mom. Those are the RPMs in the fuel injection pump. Okay. All right. One thing. Look at this. In this engine, you have intake and exhaust valve, and the injector enter directly in the middle in between both valves. Intake, exhaust, and the injector in the middle. Intake, exhaust, and the injector in the middle. What type of injection is this? Direct, direct, direct fuel injection. What type of fuel injection is this engine? Mechanical fuel injection or electronic? Electronic. It's mechanical. mechanical yeah. No, mama? You see the fuel injection pump? It's mechanical. It's not electronic. I can use this engine for different purposes. In this, mom in this moment, right now, this engine is used to produce what? Power. Power, because I have a generator here. This is the back end. Can I use that engine for other functions? Yes. For example, what happens if I replace this back end for a transmission? Yeah. Oh, I have a I have a car. Yeah. Uh, what happens if I replace this back end for a pump? Yeah. And I suction water from the river to send over there. Okay. There are a lot of functions for the same engine. This engine is installed in the John Deere. This is John Deere. It, I love it, this engine. It's installed in the tractors, John Deere. It's installed in the, in the buses, transportation. It's installed in boats. It's installed in generators. It's used in the city uh, uh, for the pumps in the... In the uh, yeah, correct. To pump it water. A lot of functions for the same engine. That's okay. One thing is the engine. Other thing is what happened here. Ah, here I can install a back end, a transmission. That's 
millions of tons. Right? Okay. What is this? Sorry. Star motor. Okay. This. Heat exchanger. changer. This one. Exhaust, exhaust, exhaust manifold. Come on here, guys. This one. Alternator. This one. That's the harmonic, harmonic balancer. balancer. Harmonic balancer. Later we are going to talk about that. This element have two rings. One external ring and other internal ring with rubber. Rubber in the, in the middle. You see the rubber? You see the rubber here? Ah, when you accelerate and decelerate, both rings try to move it in opposite direction and they stabilize. For that reason is harmonic, harmonic balance. No? Harmonic? Mm -hmm. What happened if I dance with a Russian lady? That's no harmonic. What happened if I dance with a Venezuelan lady? Oh, nice. I dance in the same frequency. Yes or not? That's the harmonic balance. All right. Uh, alternator, what is this? Tensor. That's the tensor to tense, to tense the, the, the bell, the serpentine bell. And uh, later we are going to talk about this. This oh, is cool and pump, cool and pump, cool and cool and cool and pump, cool and pump. Where is located the raw water pump in this in this engine? Raw water. Look at the raw water. Look at the impeller here. Input raw water and output raw water. And the output raw water should be entering here. I sw I flipped the position of this because I am suctioning the raw water with an electrical pump over there. That's clear? Okay. But this, this one should be f connected here. Is this pump electric too? No, it's mechanical with a gear and the gear connected with the gear of the crown and the gear of the cam. Oh, with the timing chain? Yeah, there. no timing chain, gear with gear. Oh. Gear with gear. Yeah. Which one is the pump? Look, raw water pump. So oh, that one, okay. The impeller is here and this one is? Coolant pump. pump. What is the other name for the coolant pump? Water Press pump. water pump or water right. pump or circulating yeah. pump. This is the fuel tank. This is the fuel tank. I have the fuel. I have the fuel coming from the tank. Look, the fuel enter in this filter. This filter is water separator, water separator or primary filter. Now the fuel continue and enter in this and this. Those are secondary, secondary filters. Later, we are going to talk about that. Primary filter or water separator. water separator. They have, when I see water over there, I drain the water and I close over there and I pump it again. Normally, you don't have this Mickey Mouse pump. You have an electric. What is the name of this pump? Primer pump. Primer or transfer pump. I have another primer pump in between both secondaries. Look, look, and, 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 exactly, and, and after that I open this, I bleed the system, I bleed the system, I eliminate bubbles, air. Good? Why the bubbles are no good? Because the bubbles with the pressure expand and block. This is the most simple engine, diesel. Good? Yes, sir. Difficult? Not when you explain it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.